Assalamu alaikum. Hello everyone. Today we will discuss a very important and hot topic in today's market. That is how can we integrate machine learning and deep learning tool and technique in our Django project. For this purpose, uh, at first we recognize any person's face and detect his or her recognizing time. So let's start and just watch continue. Okay, for this purpose, at first we need to collect data set of any employee. So we press add employee button and press here ID and press here employee name and press the save button. When you press the save button, it automatically saved in our employee model. Now we need to collect employee data set. Here you have shown Moshir Tofa Shamim has a lot of images, but Rana Sharkar has no images. So, at first, we need to collect Rana Sharkar's images. So, we press Rana Sharkar and collect his images. Here, given the notification or for collected images, okay. Our webcam is open now. We need to collect images. Here we press a space button. Okay, done. On. Okay, here we collected 25 images for 10 model. Now we press the training model uh, for training. And here you have also noticed that uh, the search for ID button when we press any ID then we have shown automatically this ID is uh, employee okay now we need to train the model so we press train model button in my PC has CPU so that means central processing unit but um, in CPU also, my PC speed is so less than other PC, so we have need a little bit time um, to process these uh, images. Okay, now here uh, processing is continue. Now we will discuss another topic. Uh, when we collect data set, then it's stored uh, in our data set folder according to their name. This is my Rana Sharkar 20 and here I have collected these images. Okay. According to the according to these images, as uh, automatically trained our model. Here I have used this test train.py file for training. Okay. Uh, when we press train model icon, then it call this file, file and this function, trainer function. Mm, okay. Uh, when we press train model, then it call this function. Here I call trainer function. This trainer function is included in face train dot pi. This is face train dot pi. I when it's call face train dot pi, then it automatically call this train function according to this train function on uh, my all images taint model saved in in this taint model dot CLF folder or this taint model dot CLF folder is and so had stored this taint model data set uh, as a pickle file this is a pickle file I'll no need to show here because uh, when we show this uh, as data set, we don't understand what about this data set. Okay. Uh, our tent models uh, work has completed. Now we check uh, okay, and to recognize any phases. So we press the check with BTO team and check that is Rana Sharkar or not. Okay. Our webcam is opened okay it's great here automatically detect this is done a shortcut okay uh, now we identifying our faces so we press this identifying 
Tezos button had also opened Rana Sharkar. Okay, they have you have shown this Rana. This is Rana Sharkar. Uh, and uh, now we need to detect recognizing time. So we press this detected phases button. He have shown this is Rana Sharkar and uh, his time stamp. Um, here you have shown also her detecting time. I'm um, we also search according to their name, and we have also searched according to interdate when we press her interdate and submit button, then we will show um, according to date person's recognizing time and uh, their ID. This is very interesting topic. Okay, and uh, we successfully recognize our face. That is very awesome and interesting tool and technique for today's. As here, I have used face recognition with Python packages, OpenCV packages, NumPy packages, and other packages. I will explain step by step in my easy CSE learn channel so you should subscribe my easy CSE learn channel and like this video for encouraging me thank you so much assalamualaikum